friends, Deacon Sarah here, and I am here to share our Thursday scripture share. This week we're focusing on justice, and so I wanted to share a scripture from you for you from the book of Isaiah. Hear these words. It comes from Isaiah 1. Learn to do good, seek justice, correct oppression, bring justice to the fatherless, plead the widow's cause. Today I'm sharing um, a little bit about how to work for justice. And I wanna share this image with you. It's a pyramid and it is a pyramid of engagement. And you can see that each level builds on one another. First, awareness. Awareness is maybe attending a community forum or um, watching a press conference. Maybe it's reading a book. And then it goes to interest, which might be canvassing or talking at a forum. Um, and then it also goes to participation, which would be attending some sort of rally um, or calling your legislator, making a donation to a cause, and then commitment. And that's really when you um, begin to share a personal story, maybe with the media, <clears throat> you attend a coalition meeting um, or a campaign strategy, and that you regularly donate to a cause. And last, it becomes leadership. And so that is when um, maybe you decide to run for office or you lead an organization, an organization that um, is leading the way in change. You <clears throat> are part of um, a group of directors or a board of directors. And there are board of directors that have um, youth participants on their boards. I share this because sometimes when we think of justice, we only think about um, maybe protesting. That's kind of the loudest way that we think about justice, but there are lots and lots of ways for us to be engaged in those words from Isaiah, to care for the community um, and to begin to learn and understand and act um, how to best care for one another in this world. So I hope that you'll think about that and maybe ponder where you are on that pyramid of advocacy.